know y'all thinking there's something wrong with my audio right now, but it ain't. Um, I just want to change the music, but I can't find the music yet. So yeah, this is it. What's up, YouTube? What's up, my love bugs? What's going on? What's popping and what's happening? You already know, as you can see, I'm here with a different type of video, y'all. Um, yeah, this gonna be a little different. Um, yeah, this gonna be a little different, y'all. It's gonna be a little different. Um, today, as y'all can see, I got this little towel on, on me, y'all already know. So today, y'all, I will be uh, telling you guys just a little bit about my dread journey. There you go, I got dreads. And I will be really twisting my hair, but today I am going to be doing something new. I'm going to be using foam curlers. And if you don't know what foam curlers are, they're just curlers, but except they're foam. Really good for dreads if you want to ever curl your dreads, but they take a really long time. It takes patience and just a lot, so... I already washed my hair. So y'all, I just washed my dreads. Ooh. You know, if my dreads can look like this when it dries, I'll be perfectly fine. But when that thing dries, look at that. When that thing dries, y'all, it's a whole nother um person. Get out my dreads! irritating me um yes yeah, a whole nother person so you know so just stick here and we're gonna be getting roll now of course y'all not gonna see me retwist the whole thing that's just too much work for y'all i know like it's too much work for me okay too much work for me so y'all can see it i'm hungry i'm sorry y'all i'm hungry No, you're not getting none of my chips. My dog. Hold on a second. I'll be back. So, yeah, y'all. I put a mixture of coconut oil and wild growth light mixture. I don't know if y'all see that. Uh, let me turn it down a little bit. And that. I put that. Not gonna be. No, that's good enough. It's not too fair. Yeah. My face is ashy because I wash my hair, so I ain't putting nothing on my face. So that's what I do. <laughs> hey, y'all. So I, you see I did a whole wardrobe change because I just wasn't feeling that. And it was uncomfortable. And it was cold in here. And my monthly on. And it's just too much. So. All right, y'all. Let's, let's get this on roll. Oh, and I got my little bro bottle sprayer. My dog chewed up half of it, but I got it. I need to get a new one. So, first, I'm just going to take my oil, put this on my hair, and I'll just tell you guys a little bit about my, my dread journey. So, I've had my dreads for three years now, um, and it'll make it four years in May. So, I had them for three years, and it doesn't, honestly, it doesn't even seem like I've had them that long. That's how crazy it is. Honestly, it does I couldn't believe it. When I found out, it was three years. Um, and I'm going to tell you guys, um, just the reason why I decided to get dreads in the first place was because, um, okay, I have 4C type hair. And if you know anything about 4C, then you know how, um, it, not to say it's hard to manage, but it can be hard to, to keep up with I guess you can say if um if you are a struggling college student um so I moved off to and okay so back home um my little sister she does hair she's good at doing hair and she um she used to do my hair all the time um uh, she used to do my hair all the time so um when I moved up to Orlando I didn't have nobody to do my hair and sh when I seen her she would do it but that was once in a blue moon so I'll be stuck with the same hairstyle and I'm a natural 4C girl and if you're a natural 4C girl then you know you know you know you know so it got to a point where I was like okay I don't know what to do with my hair I don't have money to get my hair done 
every, you know, I don't have money to get my hair done. I, I don't know how to, I know how to, I know how to wash my hair, make sure I comb it out, you know, detangle it, but I don't know how to do my hair. I don't, I don't know, you know, and I don't have money to try to get somebody else to do my hair. So, um, I was like, you know what? Where did, I was like, you know what? I am going to, I am going to, um, I said, you know what? I think I'm going to lock up. So I used to do these little twists to my hair, to my forces to my hair. I used to do like little regular twists, like two strand twists to my hair with my real hair. And if I have a picture, I'll insert the picture. But I used to do like regular, like just two strand twists and just leave it like that. Um, take it out, do it again, take it out, do it again. And I got tired of doing that because I worked a lot and I went to school at the same time. So I was like, I can't keep doing this to myself. I can't. And like, I would have to do my hair. Like I would end up doing my hair like late at night, like late at night. Like it'll be like super late at night. And I was just like, I can't do this to myself anymore. Like I just can't. So, um, I was like, you know what? You know what I'm going to do? I am going to, um, I said, I am going to lock my hair up. So it was before my sister's graduation party. And I just remember, um, I just remember, oh yeah, just let you guys know, these are the foam curlers. I got them in jumbo, right? The first set I got was in jumbo, right? The, and then I ran out and then I had to go to the store and I didn't remember what size I got. I thought I got them in medium. Turns out I got them in jumbo. So I got two different sets. I got medium and jumbo. And I'm going to show you guys the curls are very different. The curls are, these are like, if you do these, these are like little, little curls. Like they're curls, but they're little curls. If you, when, when you see the jumbo, the jumbo are big curls. Okay, so y'all gonna see the difference, but um, anyways, um, so it got to a point where I was like, okay, I gotta do something about this. So I ended up, um, I ended up twisting my hair up. I started my dreads with two strand twists, just for anybody, if they want to know. I started my dreads with two strand twists. So I was like, I am going to, um... So I was like, I am going to, yeah, you just curl it up y'all and put it just in case for the people that want to know how you do it. You just curl it up. I twist it and I curl it up and then you have to like, cur like twist and curl up at the same time because you know, you don't want your twist to be come out. So yeah, but, um, so I got the. I got, so I did my two shrimp test. I remember this day, because it was the day before my sister um, graduation party, and my mom did graduation party, I mean graduation, graduating from college, and my mom was coming up, and I just remember saying, I gotta have my hair done, and I had to go to work the next day, and I just remember saying, I gotta do my hair, I gotta have my hair done, this, that, the third, so I, um, I did my hair and everything. And so I did my two strand test that day and it just came out. Hey, get from over there. Did my two strand twist that day and it came out pretty good. I wasn't mad at myself at all. It came out pretty good. Came out really, really good on um, the day I, um, that day. Um, but I did rush a little bit when it got to the top cause I got really tired and I, and I can see the difference on the ones that I rushed on. And it's the ones like right here in, in the middle of my head. And they're a little big. I don't know if like you guys can tell. But these are a little big. Um, it was this one. It's another one. But some of uh, this one. And I'm really mad at myself for that. Because it those two dreads are I really like those two dreads are really big. And I they really aggravate me sometimes because I feel like you can tell the difference but my boyfriend is like no but leave them like they're fine um but they I feel like they're also my strongest ones on my head so <laughs> just leave them alone 
Um, I also like to say, y'all, I took out three of my dreads because they were just, look at this, look at my peasies. Um, I took out like three of my dreads, y'all, because they were just terrible. Like they were so, it, I don't know why so much lint was filled in the, those three, but it was so much lint filled in those three. I'm going to show y'all. This is one of them that I took out. If you can kind of tell, see, it's a, just a twist. Um, but I mean, you can't see them. Just start over. That's all. <laughs> Honestly. But yeah, I did my twist that day. And I took it. So. And that was how I started my dreads. That's exactly how I started my, my dreads, y'all. I didn't. I didn't do nothing else. But that's that I started my dreads two strand twist. And. It's been a journey ever since then. It's been a journey ever since then, y'all. Um, and I just want to say, if you're thinking about getting dreads, um, don't start dreads for the reason I started them. I started dreads because I had nothing else to do with my hair. Um, if you start dreads, do it. You'll realize that it's more than just, I don't have nothing to do with my hair, so I'm doing this. Dreads are just, dreads are way more than I don't have nothing to do with my hair. So I'm doing this because that's the way I started it. And um, it's not, I wouldn't say it's good because I feel like if you start like that, then you're going to eventually want to take it out when you get the money to do your to do your hair, to get your done on a regular basis. But I've come to a point where I realized how much my dreads um, mean to me. Like, I'm, I'm, um, I'm stuttering. Like, take for in So, y'all, like, if you don't know, people, so if y'all guys don't know, people look at people, a lot of, some people, I'm not going to say all people, some people look at people with dreads and automatically think that they're dirty automatically think that this person is this way and that way and just whole lot of stuff that we're not and sometimes it can stop you from getting hired for a job sometimes um it can make people look at you different it can do a lot of stuff um i've been told i've been told like it, it, it just can do a lot and i've encountered all of that i've encountered all of that and it's crazy because you already think because you black like people gonna look at you a certain kind of way get dreads okay if you really want to see how people look at you different get dreads i am t bro let me tell you something people are redonkulous like you go in for interviews expecting one thing and you notice it like you notice that they notice that you got dreads and it's the funniest thing ever because they try to keep their face normal but they're not good at it <laughs> so i'm just like okay but you know you still go in with a great mindset for interviews and you know you do your thing um so it's okay i mean i've learned to deal with it it is what it is um, but I will say, like, it's it can be a lot if you're... I think I gotta twist this one. Uh, I will say, if you're not used to it, don't do it. I will say, if you're not ready for that, don't do it. Um, Because people, yeah, people judge. Somebody, they'll say, oh, you should, you should take out your dreads and do, like, weave i've heard that before you should take out your dreads and do like weave no thank you i'm i'm fine i'm fine thank you though thank you been there done that and it's nothing wrong with weave i just been there and i done that and i i'm good i'm good i wanted i'm good with this thank you though thank you though been there done that um you have people and so now when I do job, when I do job applications, I dead ass put, I have dreads. I promise you, I will find somewhere to put, I have 
dreads. If I'm doing an application online, I have dreads. I put it on the application somewhere. Is there anything you else you need to tell me? I have dreads. They are well kept though. Like I said, I said like I have dreads. They are well because what happens is people think you got to say that they're well kept because automatically a lot of Caucasian people when you put on the application I have dreads they automatically think about freeform dreads and there's nothing wrong with freeform dreads it's just that a lot of Caucasian people they think that people who have freeform dreads are this way and that way and they and they just don't know a lot of a lot of people with freeform dreads are the most free spirit ever some of them not all of them because there is a lot of people with dreads that are you know and there's a lot of people with dreads that are really cool so um yeah so i, I just put let me not say well kept because that's rude um because free forms are well kept it's just that i say that i keep them done that's why i say i say i keep them done though and i can put them in a style this then third i always put that on my application because i i hate how like to go into interviews and it's automatically like Oh, so can you do anything with your hair? Like, is that the, you know, is that your hair on a regular basis? I just retwisted my hair for this interview. Yes, this is my hair. But it is what it is. I mean, you get used to it. But I will say, though, like, that's that's a, that's something with um, dreads. You have to it's a journey my grandfather has dreads so it is something that you have to it is something that you have to really like know you want to do it's something that you really have to know you want to do because it can be a lot. It can be a lot. Hope y'all can see him. Hope y'all seen all of it. <laughs> all right, y'all. So this is that for the rest of the day. I'll be around, walking around the house like this, walking like around my place with the style. No, nah, but I'll be walking around my apartment like this. Well, my man, oh, I think something just popped. No, oh, we're just trying to move from around each other. I think that's another twist. Yeah. All right, yeah. I think I got everything. Hope I did. You would hate to have a bunch of curly dreads and then that one just straight one. Boy, this sh Oh, let me show y'all what I retwist my hair with. So, hold up. Oh, shoot. <laughs> this is what I retwist my hair with. So, I retwist my hair with this, and basically it stimulates root, root growth, strengthens locks, prevents itchy and dry scalp, prevents breakage, and that's it. That's what it's supposed to do. Um, I use this whole set. Um, I wash my hair with their shampoo, and I use their conditioner. So I use their whole set, and I will say, like, um, I do like their shampoo and their conditioner. Um, I realize I don't... I, I I do like their shampoo and conditioner, so I do use both of them. I especially since it tingles, you know, my scalp, the shampoo. Um, so I use both. I use all of it. Um, just to let you guys know, cause I know I I told you you guys what I put in my hair after I wash it, but I didn't necessarily tell you guys what I use to like wash my hair and retwist my hair. So I use the the Jamaican um the Jamaican mango and lime um set shampoo and and the conditioner. Hey y'all, what's up? So I am back and I'm gonna take this out of my head because so it is what time is it? It's like seven something in the morning. 
and I had to just take my man to work. So I thought I had to be to work for early in the morning, but I don't. But it's okay, because I'm going to take them out now because I slept with these in my head. And I more like took a nap because I was waking up every two seconds. Couldn't sleep with these in my head. Couldn't do it. So I'm on my last two, y'all. I'm on my last two. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yes, please. Period, pool. Yes, 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 period, period, the baddest bitch out here, period, 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 uh, uh, you know, a little bouncy, you know what I'm saying, a little bouncy, you know, but yes, so I am done, like, hold on, let me hit my edges real quick, let me brush them down a little bit. They're a little, they're a little peasy. Lips was ashy. Okay, cuts. All right, y'all. So this is the finished product. I'm just gonna run my fingers through it just a little bit. But I kind of like the t the curls tight, so I might not. Um, but yeah, this is how we're looking. Alright y'all, so this is the finished product and oh, I need a shade. Alright y'all, so this is the finished product and I got one more right there. It was blending in. Look at that. Look at that sh there. Alright, there we go. Now this is the finished product. Let me make show. Sure. Y'all, so this is it. Um so as y'all can I, like I told y'all, I have um I had jumbo and I had medium curlers. You cannot tell the difference. I don't think you can. I don't think you can really tell the difference between the jumbo and the what you call it. Um, so this is it, y'all. Um, I like to when I do this to my hair, I like to put it up like this. But I like to put it in a little ponytail up here for some odd reason. I just do. I think it's the cutest thing ever. All right, y'all. I love y'all. I'll see y'all in my next video. Make sure to comment, like, subscribe. Tell me what you guys want to see next. I will try my best to do them. I need to get my eyebrows done because they're looking crusty, dusty, and rusty. Period. See you guys.